the scene on Detroit's northwest side where two people are dead and several people have been shot. That's where we find 7 Action News reporter Julie Bonovich. Julie. Hi, that's right, Vic. There are a total of nine victims out here. Those two people dead does not include uh, a shooting victim because she didn't get shot, but she was driving with other people who got shot in a car that's out here. I don't know if you can make it out. It's a red vehicle that crashed into a fire hydrant. She was ejected from the vehicle and died. Three other people were in that car with her. They were shot. Uh, police recovered a gun from that car, they're telling us. It's, they were speeding away from a shooting scene at a vigil on Patton when they crashed into that hydrant. It's not clear yet if they were involved in doing any of the shooting. Police don't know what that vigil was for. Uh, we're told that also on Patton when the shooting broke out, one man is dead over there, one person in critical condition, two people in temporary serious condition. Police did arrest uh, a man over there. They also found two guns over there, including an assault rifle that was in the home on Patton. Again, two people were arrested at the shooting at the vigil. Police not sure why the vigil was happening or who it was for, but they do know that there was a shooting on this street on Burt where we are right now earlier in the week. They don't know if it's in retaliation for that. And they went to a candlelight vigil to support someone that had lost a loved one and something jumped off there and I guess it went from there. They said about five, six been shot and they not, that's all they're saying. So the woman that you just heard from is a mother who showed up at the scene here because she recognized uh, her cousin's vehicle, this red vehicle. They do not know. Uh, she does not know the condition that her son is in. Uh, she's not sure, so she went to the hospital, but she couldn't get in. They told her she can't get in until 8 a.m. Why? Because police have already had to arrest six people that were showing up to Sinai Grace and Detroit receiving hospitals because once family members got there, they were fighting with each other. So again, uh, police not even letting family into the hospitals until later this morning because of this. Again, two people dead out here after a vigil on the northwest side. Live from Detroit, back to you in the studio.